Hi guys, so today I'm going to be playing an easier level than I usually do, it's called OPSM1. But yeah, also I am trying to get to 30k right now and I will have a special video at 30k, so uh, make sure to subscribe, I really appreciate it. And it's a kind of easy and extreme demon that's meant to be pretty fun. Uh, it's a modern style and it just got bounced and re-verified by 12 Kelvin and yeah they're a great player and it should be a lot more fun now so if you tried it before and didn't like it you should definitely try again now. I have never played this level before. As soon as I start playing it I know it's going to be like pretty unique. I'm really liking the design the colours for this level, even though I can't really actually fully appreciate the colours because I'm like colorblind but whatever. I think the colours are really nice. And like the design level I I'd say there aren't very many modern extreme demons right now. Which is a shame because I think it works really well. So yeah, this uh, level has a kind of confusing wave. It has a lot of like different paths that you could go down. Which I think is quite interesting. So I actually don't know where to go here, which is unusual. Oh I see it moves. Okay, the souls move. Of course there's the there's a Discord flushed thing emoji. Of course. I mean why not why not have a flush face in there to spice up the level? But yeah, this level's like really unique and I like it a lot. It's a bit out of my skill range though. Yeah, damn, this these backgrounds they're actually popping off with this uh, design of the level. I really like this. Yeah, and I will I will try to like critique the level and not just phrase it universally. Like if there's something bad that I find that I'll point it out. No, so far this is really nice. Okay, so this part is a little hard to understand. I'll, I'll get the hang of it. So I can actually just micro click that. Okay, okay, cool. So this part seems a lot harder than the other parts. I don't know if that's just me like not being able to read it as well or if it's actually the part being harder but it feels a lot harder than the other parts so far. I do like how this part is laid out because they've got a kind of like more distant part of the song so they kind of restricted the view and that's pretty epic like how they've like kind of made it fit with the song. Because the, the calmer part of the song there like you can't see as much of the level I don't know it's, it's, it's a cool idea. Well, they put those things where you're meant to jump, that helps a lot. So I hate like having to find the quick pattern of a thing. Like say I was playing El Dorado, it took me like so long to find a quick pattern for like the first UFO. It took forever, but this one actually has like the dots, so you can see where you're meant to jump. So that's great. Okay, so I think I've got to be a little more graceful with this. I really like these saw designs as well. Normally people like kind of overlook saw design in levels. In this they certainly haven't, it's, they look pretty nice. They get on bias, like modern is like one of my favourite styles, especially when it's done like this. Ooh, I'd, I'd like to know how they got the name of this level, like, it's a bit random. Ooh, it has one of those portal things, okay. Those things usually aren't fun in levels, I would put a gravity orb there instead to make it easier. I think that's a skill issue though. Okay, so I, I do... This is a tough quick. Yeah, I, I'm loving the attention to detail, like all the little like, abstract bits that are floating around the blocks. The backgrounds and everything, it's just like, it's very well done. And the colours and, yeah, it's just... I really like this part, although at this point, the background feels very empty. It could do with more detail, because right now it's, it's literally just like a solid colour. And like, that's kind of boring for the level, so they could have done a little more for the background on this part, I think. Damn, this this song has so many like, parts to it. There are so many different like, parts of the song, like, it sounds different at every part. This is interesting. That, now that's a nice duel, I have to say. Okay, so we're nearly at the end of the level now. Just going through the final part. Oh, no, there we go, there we go, it's finished, it's finished. So yeah, good job to those people who uh, bounced and playtested the level as well. I think it's uh, really well done. Apart from apart from the bit where your views is restricted, that bit's quite hard. But apart from that, I yeah, everything seems to be the same difficulty and very fun. So yeah, good job. And yeah, now I'm going to check if the macro I made actually works. And if it doesn't, I'm going to be very sad. Jeez. I think this, uh, this wave has to be my favourite part of the level. Okay, so I, I keep on getting this. I don't know why I keep losing so much FPS at these parts, because I shouldn't be. You can't be so sure you've done it right. 
but then you haven't, and it's like, bro. Damn, I don't know why I'm getting this like, but I'll try and fix it for another video. Alright, well, uh, I, I'm gonna record the showcase now, so, um, yeah, enjoy the video.